The Cherokee County Courthouse, with its gleaming marble walls and its fourth floor jail, looks great on the outside, but inside it's a different story. It's not pretty, it's not secure, it may not even be safe. Sheriff Bo Ballard showed me the hole the workmen left by the elevator where the trustees smuggled in the liquor. The area is often left unguarded because there's only one jailer and he can't spend all his time watching this one hole. So on Friday, with 30 men in the jail, a fight broke out and 20-year-old Eric Treffler ended up dead. Sheriff Ballard says it would never have happened if he could have gotten the county commissioner to hire him some more jailers and to make necessary repairs to the jail. Right now, it doesn't even meet minimum fire safety standards. And while some of the improvements have been made, County Commissioner Trammell Carmichael has not done the more expensive work like posting exit signs and building fire escapes. I don't know where I've got my wires crossed with the commissioner, but it seems that I have and in some way. I've evidently offended him in some way. But uh, I, I'm very pessimistic about getting the budget approved or getting what I really need here at this time. Ballard has cut off all family visits because he has no way to keep visitors from passing contraband to prisoners. He says that for just over $15,000, he could make almost all the needed improvements, but he can't get the money from the county commissioner. Commissioner Carmichael would only answer my questions with a no comment. The best hope for the prisoner stands with a pending bond issue that goes to a vote in two weeks. He could build a new jail, but not until 1983. So this is how the Cherokee County Jail looks now that they've taken out most of the prisoners. And this is about as good as it can look until they get some more money. Of course, if the bond issue passes, they will get a new jail in a couple of years. But the question is, how can they improve things between now and then? And if things keep going the way they have been going, odds are they won't do much more improving at all. From the Cherokee County Jail, Gary Reeves, Action News.